It has not been a smooth journey. Kilemendi could certainly do with a better bike. And although his old motorbike slows down his life, it doesn't kill his optimism for a brighter future. But then, Kilemendi is not exactly your average villager, at least going by his friends. Life's a journey, they say. Kilemendi trots with his old motorbike on the Dutch road of Kamagut village. These roads he's known all his life. 49 years ago, this same dirt road in Kamagut village, Wasingishu County, would lead him and William Ruto to the Kamagut Primary School. And though much has changed over the years, this mud thatched class still stands. And down the memory lane, Kilemendi would tell us of a friendship that would pass the test of time. <laughs> That entering Kamagut is a blessing became true for the two childhood friends. As neighbors, they would use the same path to education. One class, two friends with different parts in life that change their status but not Kilimendi's perception. Changing fortunes have necessitated a change of lifestyle for the DP. That means, for instance, accessing him is no longer a walk-in affair thanks to the security cordon around him. But Kilemendi has not allowed his friend's VIP status come between them. When his friend William was going through a tough time, the burial of his brother, Kilemendi, would attend the burial. His friend had other friends with him. They would all sit at the high table with friends in high places with newspaper cuttings as part of a good memory. He says his chat with the president lasted more time than our interview with him. Kilemendi would do so. He is educating his 10 children out of his on and off business of selling cows and his motorbike business. Well, not as promising, but he soldiers on in life's journey. This three bedroom house is yet to be completed. He is building it himself at his own pace. It's taken him 15 years and the work of his hands pleases him. He's contented with aching a living the hard way. Sasa, uwanga na redikanga na yangu. Nikuwa na baskili, uwanga na gari, ndasifu baskili yangu. He may be outspoken by nature, but Kilemendi refuses to be drawn into discussing if his friendship with the DP and the president has brought him any material or cash fortune. But he is clear that no promises or lack of them will come between their friendship. Life is a journey, they say, and when the two childhood friends would part ways at this junction with Deputy President using this route to head home and Kilimendi using this other route to head home, despite life taking them to different routes, their friendship 
still remained intact. At his home, Kilimendi is the undoubted VIP. He may never experience the trappings of power enjoyed by his friend William, but he is happy in his own castle, or as he puts it, bite what is yours and be happy. After all, he's not just Clement Kosge, but Kilimendi, the childhood body of the DP. For now, Kilimendi is a simple villager, happy to count his friends in high places. Masikandie Citizen TV, Kamagot Village, Wasengeshu County.